Jay-Z has been accused of pitting Beyonce against Taylor Swift after he called out the Grammys for never awarding his wife Album of the Year, moments before Swift broke records by winning the accolade for the fourth time. In a move that viewers claimed was reminiscent of Kanye West's infamous 2009 MTV VMAS speech, Jay-Z launched into an impassioned rant as he pointed out the ludicrousness that Beyonce is the Grammy's most awarded artist with 32 honor, but none for the top prize. The Brooklyn-born rapper made his speech at Sunday night's Grammys when he was honored with the Dr. Dre Global Impact Award for his contribution to the music industry, with his 12-year-old daughter Blue Ivy standing on stage beside him, and Beyonce looking on from their table in the audience, dressed in just off the catwalk Louis Vuitton by Pharrell Williams. Jay-Z spoke about the importance of dream, drive, and ambition before referencing his wife of 14 years. I don't want to embarrass this young lady, but she has more Grammys than everyone and never won album of the year, Jay-Z said. So even by your own metrics, that doesn't work. Think about that. The most Grammys, never one album of the year. That doesn't work. The camera then cut to Beyonce, looking slightly apprehensive in the audience. Taking aim at other nominees, Jay-Z continued, Some of you are going to go home tonight and feel like you've been robbed. Some of you may get robbed. Some of you don't belong in the category. When I get nervous, I tell the truth. Viewers were quick to speculate if he was taking aim at Taylor with his remark, who has received 52 Grammy nominations and won 14, four of which have been album of the year. Her latest win saw her triumph over Boy Genius, The Record, Janelle Mani, The Age of Pleasure, John Batiste, World Music Radio, Lana Del Rey. Did you know that there's a tunnel under Ocean BLVD, Miley Cyrus, Endless Summer Vacation, Olivia Rodrigo, Guts and SCA Saw? Conversely, Beyoncé has been nominated for 88 competitive Grammy Awards, six times for Album of the Year. Jay-Z has also been nominated for 88 competitive Grammy Awards, winning 24 of them. Like his wife, six of his nominations have been for Album of the Year. Taking to X, formerly Twitter, during Jay-Z's speech, viewers compared his rant to Canai's while one fan noted that men have tried to pit Beyonce and Taylor against one another, noting, so Jay-Z and Canai West are best mates again. At least she was able to finish this time. It's funny, Taylor Swift and Beyonce literally show up for each other. It is toxic masculinity that perpetuates the wicked female narrative. Hashtag GRMMYs. Others added, Jay-Z is a mad let you finish away from being Canai. Hashtag GRMMY. Jay-Z really just pulled a Canai. This acceptance speech is mad awkward. Beyonce having Taylor and Can I flashback during Jay-Z's hashtag GRMMY speech. Jay-Z gave the diet soda version of Can I's Beyonce had the best video of all time rant up there. Why didn't they pan the camera to Taylor when Jay-Z was talking? Hashtag Grammys. No tea, no shade, but the fact that Taylor Swift predictably wins hashtag OTY every time she's nominated sort of proves Jay-Z right. Hashtag GRMMYs, Jay-Z gonna be mad about Taylor winning another album of the year. Taylor Swift sitting at the hashtag Grammys wondering if Jay-Z was shading her. It's annoying BC one of the Grammy voters were like, Beyonce has so many Grammys she doesn't need to always win, but here is Taylor on her way to winning for AOTY when Bay has none. They push white women forward just to compete and overshadow phenomenal black women. In this essay, I just hate everything Taylor stand for. Being average af and so rewarded for while black women have to be extraordinary just to get in the damn room. Beyonce and Taylor have been pitted against each other for 15 years since Can I Declared the Mother of Three was robbed at the 2009 MTV VMAS. When Taylor, who was 19 at the time, was giving an acceptance speech for Best Female Video, Can I stormed the stage and declared that Beyonce's music video deserved to win over Taylor's.